In this problem, we're told at what temperature do the Fahrenheit and Celsius scales have the same numerical value? And then B is at what temperature do the Fahrenheit and Kelvin scales have the same numerical value? So the way we're going to do this is by using the formula as converting from temperature. So we can convert from Celsius into Fahrenheit using this formula, 9 over 5 times uh, the Celsius, right, whatever it is in Celsius, plus 32. And then you can convert from Kelvin into Fahrenheit by doing 9 over 5 and multiply it by the Kelvin value, minus 273.15 plus 32. And the way we're going to do it, or find where they're the same, right, all we can do is, sub, or all we have to do is just substitute C in for F, and then K in for F, because we're finding where they're exactly the same. So basically, we just got to plug in C for this, and then K for this, and solve for whatever C is. So let's just go ahead and start with the top one. So I'm just plugging in uh, C for F, so C equals 9 over 5, uh, C plus 32. So what I'm going to do is just minus 9 over 5 C from both sides. So minus 9 over 5 C, this is going to become minus 4 over 5 C, and it's going to be equal to 32. And then if we want to solve for C, just minus 5 over 4 times it by both sides, right? And then minus 5 over 4. So C is going to be equal to, so 32 multiplied by uh, minus 5 over 4. You're going to get that it equals 40. So basically they're the same when celsius is equal to 40 or minus 40 sorry so your answer to the first part is going to be minus 40 so a we'll just say minus 40 and then let's go ahead and do b now so b is going to be at what temperature do the fahrenheit and kelvin scales have the same so as we did c plugging in c for this one we're just going to plug in k because we're trying to find when they're the same so it's going to be k right instead of f now we have k so k equals 9 over 5k minus this plus this so we're going to have k equals and then i'm going to uh, multiply this out right so it's going to be 9 over 5 times k and then we multiply 9 over 5 times minus 273.15 and if you go ahead and do that you're going to get minus uh, 49 or 491.67 and then we just have plus 32 so if we minus 9 over 5k from both sides this is going to become minus 4 over 5k right and this is going to go away so we have minus 4 over 5k it's going to be equal to minus and then you have minus 491.67 plus 32 so you want to go ahead and add that so it's going to be minus 491.67 plus 32 you're going to get minus 459.67 and so now that we've got it like this, all we have to do is uh, multiply both sides by minus 5 over 4. Right, so we cancel this, so we just have k. We have minus 5 over 4 here. So you want to do 459.67 times 5 divided by 4. And so keep in mind the minus signs are just going to cancel. So you're going to get k equals, and then it's going to be 574.5875. So you can round if you want. I'm just going to leave it like this, though. So your answer to B is 574.5875. So yeah, this is going to be your answer to A. So when F or the Fahrenheit is equal to Celsius, and then when Fahrenheit equals Kelvin, this is going to be your value. But yeah, so these are your answers, and hopefully you found this useful.